2010 Camaro 2SS Custom. New project. Haven't posted in a very long time. Um, my version of the inner chiller um, system for the superchargers, custom made. On the left hand side, you have a five gallon methanol tank with a snow performance stage two system. You have on the right hand side a 15 gallon water and alcohol mix fuel cell um, with the air conditioner lines and evaporator core built into it. Um, to my knowledge, this is the first one that's actually in the trunk. Um, most of these are mounted in the uh, front bumper and they actually cut the impact support. I didn't want to ever do that. Um, so this is my version of it. It is a knockoff. Um, up top, you got the return lines. You've got the air lines, which keep the tank um, not pressurized down to the bottom of the car. You have the filler neck. You have a fuel sending unit in there to tell the level sensor. Um, I just built a wood floor underneath. This carpet just flips up and then you can still get to the factory battery. Everything's double carpeted and glued. Um, the entire back of the car is rewired. Everything's neat and organized. And I added the second battery in the back of the car for extra cranking power and all the extra electronics. Came up pretty nice. Coming around the car, it's going to be a little hard to see. Looking in the back of the car, everything is neat and clean. Snow performance, high pressure line that feeds the pump, which is mounted in the corner. You have a solenoid for the on and off trigger. The wiring still needs to get tucked away, that's temporary. You have a bulkhead fitting um, drilled and tapped into the tank. All AN lines running down and underneath the car. The air conditioner lines are in the car to avoid any heat soak because I was worried about adding 30 feet of lines near the exhaust and how much I'd actually lose. Um, thermal probe to engage in the dashboard to tell me the temperature of my version of the inner chiller tank. Um, everything is technically working right now. Um, I'm still in the process of checking the system. It is holding vacuum overnight. Has not moved. Um, thank God. Um, this gets a little messy over here right now because we're still in the process. But I have two fittings tapped into the high side and the low side. The low side is three quarter inch. High side line, the pressure feed or liquid line is 5 16 um, I added a service port for the low side here. Reason for this is it's almost impossible to get to the service port on the back of this thing. It's just a pain in the ass to fill it. Um, the last line needs to get crimped here on the appointments Tuesday. And then I should have a follow-up video of this thing actually working. All the lines to the liquid intercooler are ran underneath the car. You're roughly about 18 gallons of fluid. It's an alcohol and water mixture right now. I'll probably switch back over to antifreeze depending on how it behaves. And this is just an example of the stage two snow performance kit methanol system that's in there. Uh, we'll keep you posted more as the next video comes up, but this is my knockoff version of uh, an inner chiller or kind of like a cold tank system. See how it goes on Tuesday once we charge it.